temperatures rise, it's not flooding that has residents in one Detroit neighborhood worried. Yeah, this is worse. I think roaches and rodents. Seven Action News reporter Ronnie Dahl is live in northwest Detroit at this hour. Ronnie, what is all this about? I can tell you this story has given me the weebie jeebies. From the front of this house, you wouldn't know the horrors connected to it, but I want you to take a look around the side. You can see the trash in the backyard, in the garage, it is filled up. And as one person in this neighborhood told me, this house is so infested, even the scrappers are scared. I can show you what I'm looking at every day I open my window. The view outside Bernice Richardson's window is less than pleasant. Mounds of trash, forgotten furniture, old mattresses. Smelly, yes, but that is nothing compared to the critters crawling out of the debris pile. They invaded the premises everywhere. I'm talking about the roaches and those big rats. The nasty neighbors moved out this past summer but left their trash behind. It's still here, just not as easy to see under the blanket of snow. But for Bernice, the fear of returning roaches is very real. We don't know what's going to happen when they warm up. We're not talking about a few roaches coming from this yellow bungalow on Goddard Street. Not even hundreds, but thousands. When you open your black can for your garbage, the top would be just full of them, almost like a carpet. They were everywhere. We sprayed and we sprayed till I was getting drunk from it myself. Bernice has lived in her home since 1953, never had a problem with rats or roaches until last summer. She's hoping the harsh winter weather has killed them off. But since the trash pile is still here, she's doubtful and wants something done before the critters return. Clean that place up. Take that filth out from over there and fumigate that house. Well, and that's what we're trying to do. You know, we spoke with several neighbors today, and they say that they complained to the city, to the health department, to the inspectors, and they did come out here. They took pictures last summer, but that was the end of it. I had a check with the city uh, late this afternoon, and they got back to me. They said the last time this property was inspected was this past July, but since it was secure, no tickets were issued, but they are going to send an inspector back out here because you can see the trash is still there. For now, we are live on the city's northwest side. Jeff and Joanne, back to you. Yeah, and as it gets warmer, they're going to go on the move.